morning vlog. Wow, this is like the definition of long time no see because I literally haven't vlogged in so long. <gasps> I thought my water hose was a snake. I'm going to class in a couple months, so I wanted to start a week in my loft because I really haven't done that in so long and you guys are like so out of the loop on my loft because I haven't vlogged so much has gone on in the past two weeks so I'm gonna go to class right now I have one summer class I'll kind of talk about everything and update you when we get back but I don't really have that much time right now because I need to get to class because it's a little bit of a walk literally 80 degrees and it's like 8 40 in the morning which is so crazy to me. So it's very hot, but I probably will look like a sweaty, nasty mess next time I see you, but I just wanted to get this started, and yeah, we're gonna go to summer school. <laughs> Hi guys, I'm really trying to start this vlog right now, but it is, it's, it's literally 99 degrees. I'm literally letting the car cool down because the air is so loud, and then I'm gonna start it. You really didn't need to know this, but I'm so tired of sitting here staring in my car. I've been waiting for like 15 minutes now and it's still like so hot. Whenever I can breathe, I will be back. Yesterday, I started this vlog. Wow, it sounds just like old times me saying this. And I didn't vlog anything after the clip you just watched. I'm not sure why I included it, but yeah, I hope you can hear me over the air. I cannot turn it down anymore or I will die. Yesterday, I just, um, I went to class and then I went to lay out at the pool with my friend Rashi and then we went to Target, we got all our groceries for the week, and then we watched The Bachelorette. I had a busy day, I don't know why I didn't vlog, it would have been a lot of good content for you guys, but totally flopped. So I'm picking back up today, and we're just gonna go, there, there's like a guy running in the street. We're just gonna go with whatever happens the rest of this week. I feel like I just, oh he has a dog. I feel like I need to catch you guys up on my life because I haven't vlogged in a few weeks, and I actually haven't even posted a video in over a week which is so unlike me I've been on a really good streak of posting like more than once a week I've had a really busy last like two or three weeks so I just wanted to like explain what's been going on so you guys would kind of know what's up and kind of catch you up on my life so that way it's not weird and you guys aren't confused about what I'm doing yeah I am back in Alabama if you follow me on my social medias which you should if you don't you would know that but I have been here for three weeks now I came back three weeks ago wow that's kind of crazy I started summer classes last week I have them Monday through Thursday <laughs> I just went home last weekend because I was in Kennedy's wedding. It was so much fun, so beautiful. Everything was great. Thank you. I've just been really busy. The first week back in Bama, a lot of my friends came down here. They flew in from California and uh, Chicago and South Carolina so that we could just have a little reunion. And then they all left, so I didn't want to vlog anything that week. And then last week, I started classes, and then I went home for the 4th of July and Kennedy's wedding, and then now we are picking up on this week. So I've been away for a minute, so that's kind of what's going on. I was, I feel like I was going to talk to you guys about a lot of stuff. My life is like, I don't know, I just feel like I have a lot going on right now, and I haven't been able to like talk to you all because I've not been vlogging, so I haven't got to catch you up on anything, which is just kind of crazy. I guess that's um, the point of this vlog and also to like bring you guys my daily routines during summer school because this is my first time ever doing on-campus summer school. So far it's not bad, I'm only taking one class. It's supposed to be two and a half hours, but we've been just staying about two hours so it's not the worst thing. Right now we're on our way to get Starbucks because I'm sleepy. I've been staying up till like one o'clock in the morning every night and I have to wake up at like seven every morning because my class is at nine but obviously like I have to get ready, I have to walk, and we have to watch the news every morning before class. We have to watch like six different news sources or like read articles. So I have to wake up like really early to get all this accomplished before class. So yeah, that sucks. Oh, I remember something big news that I was gonna share with you guys. So if you've been an OG subscriber for a few months now, you know my laptop is literally so destroyed I, the screen has been like that since February and my mother just bought me a new one and I'm so thankful dude I have been the past two days in class just like taking notes and actually being able to see what I was doing it was like I don't know I was like wow I forgot this is how a computer is actually supposed to work and I'm really excited to start editing again because number one it is so hard to edit when half of your screen is busted up you can't see what you're doing 
number two, we finally have Final Cut Pro X. So I've always, always wanted to have that and try editing on that software. And so I got it downloaded onto this new computer and I haven't figured out how to use it yet because I haven't vlogged anything. I don't have any videos, but we are, I guess this will be the first video up that you will see that and I'm very excited to try it but I've got to figure it out first. I'm gonna take this cup and just order a grande because I've heard that they'll fill it all the way up. I'm so confused. There's so much traffic, not traffic, so much construction. Like half of Tuscaloosa is like shut down. You have to go on detours to get places and it's really, that car's doing a U-turn right now because you can't get through there. So I feel like I'm really boring you guys just talking which I am. I don't know. I just felt like I needed to catch you up on my life a little bit before I jumped on in to just vlogging every day again because you were going to be like so confused. Like what is this girl doing? Like I didn't even know she moved back to Alabama for school. Why is she taking summer class? Like blah, blah, blah. So yeah, I'm back for good and I'm so happy to be back. But I will bring you guys along for the ride this week and I'm not really sure what we're going to do, but I think it'll be a good time. So thanks for joining. If you're not already, hit the subscribe button down below and give this video a thumbs up. And yeah, so we're gonna go get some Starbucks. Sorry, I feel like really awkward. Like I really haven't done this in so long. I kind of forgot how to vlog. Oh, this is a blessing. This is the second time this summer that I've come to the Starbucks on campus. Well, it's like kind of on campus and there not been anyone in line. And usually there's like 50 cars out to the road. So this is awesome. Oh, I'm so far away. Sorry. <laughs> no, it's okay. Give you a little rundown on what's going to go on today, though. So, uh, she gets off work at 6, and she's supposed to be coming straight to my house. And we're going to go to the gym and work out, and then we're going to come back and cook dinner together. Like a little family. And then we're going to go... I'm going to go out with her tonight for T-shirt Tuesday, but I might actually end up staying in. I've just been out so late every night. Not out, but just up so late. Wait, I can go left. I just stops on. Okay, so for lunch, I did like the little zucchini pizza thing. And basically, I just like hold the zucchini and you put pizza sauce like where you would put it on pizza, I guess, like in the middle. And then I used this dairy-free cheese and put it over it. And then this is what it looked like when it was done. And it was really good. Where did I park? All right, you guys. Um, hang on. Please tell me why I am thriving. thriving. I'm currently doing better in life than I have been in a long time. Thriving in every single aspect of life. I'm on my way to Rashi's apartment. We're going to go to the gym. And then we're going to make dinner, like I said. I got a phone call from the daycare that I've been trying to work at. And I have an interview tomorrow. So that's good. I haven't had a job in too long i don't know just like everything's going really well for me right now so i can't wait for something to crash and burn and ruin it until then i'm thriving so i just want to let you guys know that and i'm probably gonna wreck since i didn't put this in the car tripod and i'm just holding it uh so i will see you guys at the gym because i've been forgetting to do so guys we're in the gym and hang on we have isolated ourselves we shut the door and we came in here to stretch. Can't see you after. <laughs> okay, I just need you guys to like look at my hair. Well, yeah, it it this is how you know I had a good workout. We just killed back and triceps and abs. We did a little bit of hit. We really did a lot of a lot of stuff. It's just kind of funny because Rashi doesn't like lift weight, so she wanted me to like teach her how. So she's probably not gonna be able to move her arms tomorrow, but that was the goal. We had a good workout, and then we came up here and we made good, healthy food. I have homework due, so my plan is to go home and kind of like fix this rat's nest. That's what's happening. I'll text you, not text you. What is wrong with me? You can so tell I haven't vlogged in a long time. I will talk to you guys after I look better. everybody it's Wednesday this week is almost over tomorrow's the last day of classes I'm currently getting my camera just shut off of that but 
anyways, I am getting ready for class. My phone has like refused to stop cutting off, so I'm trying one more time, but I've already basically straightened most of my hair. I don't I don't even know really what I had to say. I was just gonna say like I was getting ready and I have to watch the news every morning for class. We have like six different news sources we have to watch and like read online because we get quizzed over it because our class is called like news writing and reporting. As soon as I finish getting ready, I'm actually gonna put a little bit of makeup on today, which is gonna suck, but I have a job interview right after class, so I have to like somewhat present so after I get ready I'm just gonna get dressed and then we're gonna head out the door so it's only like 7:30 right now I've got up kind of early but that's what's going on oh it is hot our door has been so difficult to get open lately Let's go to class, people. Literally give it about two minutes and my hair's gonna be frizzball, but whatever, I don't care. There's literally eight people in this class, including myself, so it's actually like so much fun. I told you guys in the few videos before, I enjoy my major, especially classes where I'm actually learning things that I will be doing for my job, so I don't really have any complaints about this class. I just have complaints about going to class in the summer, but mostly because it's hot, because honestly, I'm glad that it gets me out of bed every day. I'll see you guys around 11, 11.30, whenever she decides to let us go. Okay guys, I just finished getting ready, basically just refixed my hair and I changed into like just a basic little t-shirt and I'll show you the rest and then we're gonna go to this interview. So I feel like you can't really see it in here. I tried to like move this mirror but it's just these jeans, these Steve Madden shoes and this shirt is from American Equal. Hi guys, so I'm back, I'm back, I'm back. I just got out of the interview, it went really well, I have to do like with the medical form because it's a daycare and all that and then she's gonna call me about um like when i can start so that's fun but now we're on our way to starbucks because i need starbucks i'm just getting my usual black coffee ice i don't know i just felt the need to turn the vlog back on and talk to you all 12 45 so it's kind of late but i don't care i don't have anything else to do today like that I have to do. I don't even have homework. I'm just waiting on Rashi to get off work again. Same thing as yesterday. We're gonna go to the gym and do legs. We're both like so sore this morning. We were texting about like not being able to dry our hair because we're so sore, but that's how you know I did a good workout. Are you guys bored yet? This is like the worst vlog I've ever posted, but like I haven't posted in so long I have to post. I have like exciting content coming up soon. So I feel like you're gonna really enjoy that. So just bear with me. After we work out, we'll do LD dinner again. And then we've been talking about going out tonight. I will be staying in if it rains for sure. But there's like a small chance that I might go to Innisfree or I might go with her to Harry's. I don't know. I'm also not sure why we're going five miles per hour down university right now. Literally though, I can't really complain because like I love this campus. Like I would just drive down it and look at it all the time if I could like it's so pretty there is a line at Starbucks and it's only four cars but still a line driving around like walking to class because there's so many Bamba Bound students it's so cute I'm just like ah! like yes you absolutely have made the best decision of your life to come to school here congratulations these things are the best I mean it's almost got hit by a car trying to tell you that but whatever all right, I'm gonna go now before I die. Hello, Grandma. I'm glad they cleared the tree out of the road. Okay, I apologize to the earth, but I'm drinking plastic today. I will recycle it. Okay. That is good. Okay, see you guys later. Are any roads open in Tuscaloosa? Because I don't think so. I really genuinely think they might as well just shut the whole town down redo it all with construction and then call us when they're ready for us to come back because this is ridiculous hi guys what's up it's currently friday i don't remember the last thing that i vlogged or the last day that i vlogged maybe wednesday i don't know this vlog has been like really all over the place yesterday i started editing and i finally started to figure out oh my god i just ran into a pole Final Cut Pro, so it's like very, very different than iMovie. I really didn't expect it to be so different. Hopefully this video will be up soon. Today, I just wanted to like film Friday in the vlog. It's been like a really weird vlog and we really haven't 
done anything. I just kind of have been updating you on my life and like taking you around doing pointless stuff with me. But today's really cool. Currently on my way, it's 11 o'clock in the morning. And obviously like I have makeup on, I don't have class on Fridays. I have insert outfit here. And I'm on my way to this hotel lobby to interview and sit through a little conventions or whatever, I don't, I don't, I don't really know, of Kevin O'Leary from Shark Tank. You guys know I'm a sports broadcasting major. We take a lot of different classes that don't really involve sports. It's just like my concentration. So the one summer class that I'm taking this year is called News Writing and Reporting. We have to do a hard news story and we had to kind of decide what we wanted to do on our own. And I picked this. I'm really excited. I think it's gonna be good. It doesn't start until 12, but I wanted to get there early, like I said, so I could probably interview a few people and the cops are behind me and that makes me eternally nervous, especially on campus because they love to pull people over and I hear I have my phone in my window. Oh my gosh, you guys, this is the hottest state in the United States and don't try to argue with me on that because I'm freaking dying. So I just got out of the little seminar thing and I don't know how to get out of this parking lot. So it was actually really cool and like interesting to hear him speak. He almost had me convinced to get into real estate too. Like, wow, there really is a lot of money investing and all that and stuff. Kind of just really honestly, I feel like degrees are losing their worth. Like I feel like your richest people never go to college and I'm just like, what am I doing? But I love my major because like I was sitting there like interviewing people before we went in and just like really getting them to open up and talk. And I felt like, I don't know, I just felt like it was going really good. And I was like, I freaking love this. Like I can't wait to do this for the rest of my life like preferably on a football field or like a basketball court but it's one of those things like when you're growing up and people tell you if you love what you do like you'll never work a day in your life and like I genuinely never want to graduate college like it's the best it's so much fun and all that good stuff but on the flip side of that I can't wait to like actually get a job because I'll, uh, I think I'm just gonna like love what I do they gave us these little packets you can see old Kevin here we can take pictures or anything inside. I wrote down my lead. I have my lead quote. I've got all my interviews wrote down that I did before it started outside. And then I wrote down basically just like a bunch of notes about what the speaker said. So I would have things try about the story. So I texted Jake and I was like, can we fly to New York City today? Like, I don't know, it just made me, I, I literally, that was like so random, but I'm just like in a mood. So I'm in the mood to like be productive and it's all sunny and hot outside and I'm just, I don't know, it's just a good day to have a good day, I guess. So I'm gonna go get some ice cream. For some reason, that's like what I want. And I have eight so healthy this week like I've done so good Rashi and I have worked out and so I'm just ready to go get some ice cream and chill for a minute but thanks for listening to me rant about my life and my future <laughs> okay guys I just got home and I went to Starbucks which I very clearly have already drank it all so I'm currently shopping for recruitment outfit so I'm gonna get this black skirt and this white tennis skirt I'm thinking that i'm gonna get this white dress for preference i'm thinking this for ice water tees and then i'm also getting a laptop cover and some shoes so i'm about to drop a bag of money on this but it is worth it in my opinion also i need to order all my stickers that i've picked out for um my new laptop This one cracked me up. I just saw it and had to get it. I don't know what I'm doing tonight. We talked about going out. I'm pretty tired. I had to go get that coffee and I just stayed up too late last night. I feel like this vlog is weird. 